Hey guys, I wanted to show you a little quick review of the Cricut Mini Easy Press or Easy Press Mini. It's warming up right now. I have it on high to show you. I can start using it actually. How you can use it as an iron. So for instance, if you're quilting and doing small pieces, boom, just like that. I didn't have to get my big iron out. And if you want to see that it's actually really ironing, let's iron a crease here. Gives you a nice crisp little iron there. And I really love that you can just target an area just like that. If you really want it extra, extra, you'll get a nice crisp crease. Okay, but now I'm going to show what most people are getting it for, which is not ironing, it's for the heat transfer vinyl. Okay, so this is a very, very thick piece of flannel scrap so um, normally I would probably spray a little water on this if I was ironing it but look how it's coming out I mean this is thick heavy iron heavy flannel I'm sorry and it has this awesome base and it's quite weighty um, it's not going to tip over which I love some of the cheaper knockoffs I saw people showing oh that was the warm-up button warmed up so now that we're warmed up it wasn't even on full high and it was doing that great all right so if you want to do an iron on I'm just going to do a couple of little samples here I don't want to waste a huge piece but when you're ironing on for instance you have the shiny side up but just to show you just want to iron a piece on boom and you are supposed to kind of go with constant movement and pressure when you're doing iron on and honestly this probably wouldn't even be a high level I wouldn't I could probably go to medium with this one I just wanted to show an example of a couple of different iron on and then look how if I really wanted to get close and I was ironing on something else oh look what I did the same thing I always do which is Oh, here's a good example. See, I put that upside down. That's okay because it just wiped right off of my pad. Okay, let's flip it and be normal. So here you go. You can see how close I can get without touching the other piece of vinyl, which if I was doing a project and had to set things close, that'd be much more difficult with a full-size iron. But you also got to see my mess up, which is great. And then here's the little off. Goodbye. And then we can peel it off, and you can see, and actually this one's already, ta-ta, it works awesome.